Okay, so we're starting to get into flowering soybeans now out here in our study. And so we have these different soybeans growing here with different flowers on different positions. So once you go from the vegetative stages, which we talked about in earlier videos, to the reproductive stages, you stop going from counting trifoliolate leaves, like for instance on this plant, if this were not flowering, we would be at the V1, 2, 3, 4, 5 growth stage. According to the Pedersen method, the Farron Cavanus method, we would be at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 growth stage. But we notice here we have one flower bud that's starting to open on this plant. And at this point, the R1 growth stage is when one flower is open anywhere at any node on the plant. So this plant would actually be at the R1 growth stage and beginning the flowering process. If we look at this plant here, this plant, this is the uppermost node for counting V stages. So in the Pedersen method, this would be node one, node two. The Farron Cavanus method, we'd go down from there, this would be node one and node two. And we notice that we have an open flower at one of the top two nodes on the plant in either version of the staging methods that we're using. And so this plant would be progressed to the R2 growth stage, where we have at least one open flower on one of the top two nodes on the plant.